Craft. It must be. It must be one of the. It must be like here alongside of the road. I, mean, I just missed one. That's all. Yeah, I don't think they left just one line. I don't think they left a straight. There it is. See, sitting right there. By the way, let me uh, see if I can blow this thing up. Just a second. So I'm gonna tap this. Whoops. I'm gonna tap that TNT. It's gonna start ticking and flashing. They'll blow up eventually. You're supposed to actually knock it into a building, but there are no more buildings for me to blow up. Whoops. Well, that was a whimper. Yay, ten bucks. Okay. Okay, so there's a train here. I can get, ride the train. You can see that car right there? That's the car I can get into. So, let's see. Um, let's leave the vehicle. Hop into the train right here in the ride coach. Accelerate. And eventually I can stop here at the station. See? You can stop the train at the station, wait for the smiley before attempting to load or unload. You'll see the smiley on the bottom of the screen very shortly. There it is. Right below this money right below the money score. Okay. So now that I can stop the train, I can hop right here into the car and ride it right off that ramp. Again, if I were not on the ramp, I could not take this car off the train. But now that I'm on the loading ramp, I can just drive it right off. They're most useful in training stages. Access these via the community level's communication points. Well, we'll get to that later. I don't think there's anything else here to really do. I just wanted to show you this. I'll just drive around for a bit if there's anything worth picking up. There probably isn't. You got 100% on everything, right? Uh, yep, pretty much got everything. Okay. Bone Luke Duke. Oh, yeah. Um, hit the Hit the attack button. Yeah, it just honks the torn. Nothing fancy. I mean, I guess it's just—I guess it's just for show. I guess kind of drive around here and just do nothing in particular. Like, what does this car do, really? Yeah, it plays Dixie. That's really all it does, and I don't know how I feel about that. But yeah, that's pretty much all it does. Yeah. Uh, so, um. This Rockabilly music's not bad. I want to say it's by the same people who worked on a uh, Rare, who worked on a uh, GoldenEye and Perfect Dark, and Killer Instinct. I'm not sure. I'll double check. The music in this game isn't bad. Nothing really like technically accomplished, but it's pretty good. I mean, they got some, they got some pretty good banjos here, some pretty good harmonicas here. It's not it's not a bad soundtrack. Okay. So let's get the crap out of here. Alright. Where is that? Oh, wait. Uh, check out the map in the bottom left-hand corner of the screen. I want to say that. Is that where the vehicle is? Nope, that, there it is. Yep, that's where the truck is. So that yellow bar on the edge of the circle, that determines where the truck is. That's how I can leave. So I leave the car and hop in the truck, and I'm ready to go. Blast co. Okay, so I 100% of that level. And I got all the cars. Now, I guess I could replay. Let me see what happens when I replay. Yeah, it's just a video replay. Whatever. I don't know why that matters. Well, I guess you want to see it again, but I've already recorded it, so... Whatever it is. <laughs> so, let's leave. That's if I want to redo everything all over again. Nah, everything's already been done. There's nothing else, nothing else to see here. Okay, let's exit. So we'll go to the next level and get 100% there, maybe. Okay, so we have the sign of the cross, apparently. Okay, see this? Uh, okay, this is the level we started at, the Simeon Acres. See the two vehicles in the bottom corners of the screen? Obviously, we started with the dozer on the right, but the car on the left, those are the two vehicles that are available to us on this stage, not including the train, of course. So that's kind of one way to kind of figure out if you've completed a level, is to see if you've managed to drive all the vehicles that appear here. Like this one right here. There's a vehicle right here. There's only one vehicle in this level. It's called the J-Bomb. So we'll get to that level next. But before then, Sideswipe. This is a level made. It's a tutorial level for this special Sideswipe truck. We'll show you that later. Backlash. This is a tutorial video for the Backlash, which is a dump truck with a special bed that you actually use to bash buildings down. That's a lot of fun. We'll get a chance to see that in a moment. And down here, 
is the level, the Black Ridge Works, that includes the dozer, and on the bottom left is a robot that does uppercuts. It does dragon punches, basically. So you'll see that a bit later. Let's do the J-Bomb first. This one's pretty easy to explain. So these are all the tutorial levels, I guess you could say. <coughs> Excuse me. J-Bomb. Use the A button to thrust the J-Bomb into the air over a target. Then hit the B button to dive earthwards from a height. The higher you are, the more damage you'll do, apparently. I forget. The trick with this thing, apparently, is to... is to begin your dive, your somersault dive, from a position that will allow you to destroy as much of the building in one dive as possible. So you don't just want to, you know, you don't just want to smash it one bit at a time. You want to be able to smash multiple sections of it at once. Let me hold down the, am I pressing the right button? Just a second. Kind of want to restart now. Okay, now I'm high as I can go. Press the B button. Whoop, and I completely whiffed. Oh well. Okay, so that's the, that's not bad. There's a much better way to destroy these buildings. Like, let, me, let me aim for a corner. Whoop, I missed. See, let me aim for a, I'm going to aim directly down the center of the building. See that? I was able to knock down, basically, yes, yeah, I was able to knock down most of the building in two drops. See? So it all depends on where you begin your somersault dive. See? It took only two drops, I was able to bring it down. So that's the technical part of this game. It's that, yeah, you're blowing stuff up, but you want to do it efficiently, so... You want to drop as close as you can, you know, to the to the corners of these textures that we're smashing through. See the little lines right there on the textures? That we want to go, we want to essentially overlap as many of those lines as we can. Come on. Here we go. Kind of hard to see, though, which is another problem. So, yeah, I'm not as efficient as I would like, but we're making progress at least. See? I missed that. So again, ideally I would have gone down the center of that skyscraper. So I would bring the whole thing down in just one drop like I did earlier. Okay. So I could do much better than that. So if I were gonna if I wanted to speed run it, I would do much better than that. So I got a silver medal. If I can try it again. Yeah, well let me try it again. Maybe I can go for the gold. That was a silver medal, really? Kind of surprised, actually. I have to use the right stick on my uh, D-pad. I have to use the right stick on my gamepad to adjust the camera, so it's kind of annoying. So I have to press the right stick. Don't, don't lie down on the job, doofus. <laughs> the game has cute little touches like that, like, you know, the robots will, <laughs> the robots will, you know, lie down on the job like that. Like lying down in a hammock. They enjoy their work. Did I get it? Yep, I got it. Okay, I want to get it in less than a minute. It might not happen, but... Okay. We're going to go for broke. Okay, one more. Okay. So what's left? There we go. Aim right down the center. Nope, I was in an angle. I want to go straight down, which is the other problem. Maybe I don't have to go straight down. It just seems to be the most efficient way to do it. It's kind of hard to aim otherwise. And I don't want to go too high either. Wow, see that? Right down the center. Because that's a gold, right? Yes, it was. I'll take it. And that's the time attack. So if I get gold on the level, now I can do a time attack. So let's see what happens here. Yes, that's the best time I got so far. Alright, so we can leave. We made our point. Okay, what's this? Hey, this is a level that has four vehicles in it. I, I want, is this a racing level? or well, I don't know. I'll figure that out later. Actually, it can't be a racing level if there's a... See the J-bomb over there on the bottom left-hand corner? If there's a J-bomb on this level, I'm pretty sure it's not a race. But we'll get to that. Okay, what's next? Uh, let's do the Backlash. It's a lot of fun. Um, which Constructicon was this? I don't remember. <laughs> was it... Yeah, Scrapper. It's a Scrapper, right? Yeah, we'll call it Square. He is a scrapper. Actually, his name is Backlash. So he's got an Amadria. So use the X button to skid the truck when going into a turn to drift. Well, to skid, basically. You're not doing donuts, technically. 
I'm going to need a silver medal before progressing. This technique must be mastered for later levels. And you can also back into a building. Use bumps to get the backlash airborne and cause maximum damage. That is a lot of fun. Hopefully I'll be able to do that in this level too. But you can see the technique here. So it's a cute little tutorial they got going on here. See? Well, not like that. Like that. So we'll do that. Again, this takes a bit of practice once you get used to it. It's mad fun. That's the wrong button. I gotta press the X button. I can also try and just... I had to practice going reverse. That's the left trigger is to go in reverse. So I can press X to skid like that. <laughs> See that? <laughs> nice little hydroplane, I guess. I want to spin out, technically, not a hydro. There's no water here, right? There you go. Like that. And you can really go nuts by doing stuff like that, see? <laughs> see, that, that's, that's the kind of nonsense I'm talking about. You can't, you can't do this in other games. So I kind of wish, you know, where would stop making whatever kind of game they're making now and do some more stuff like this. Super technical puzzle games, like puzzle action games like this. It's kind of it's like a little physics engine, actually. It's a cute little physics puzzle they got going on here. Oh, that's the bump. Okay, let's see if I can run to this bump. Get it airborne. And then when I land, I land on top of the building, and it goes down. Okay, I didn't hit the, I didn't hit the ramp. Let's try again. You know, telling me to skid right there on the red arrow, and I missed. Okay, not good enough. Takes a bit of practice to figure out all the properties of this skid they got going on here. Nope. Nope. Well, I got it, so there's that. Sometimes I get it on the first try, sometimes it takes five or six, because I'm not doing it right. Practice. Practice matters, kids. Got it. See? It took me a minute to bring down that stupid building. <laughs> That's probably a bronze. Yeah, it's a bronze. Let's try again. So I know I can get a silver here. Well, I need to get a silver before I can advance, so let's do this. But yeah, you're going to need definitely need this in later stages. Because there are going to be uh, trucks roaming about, and it's going to be a lot tougher. Where's that bump? Let me get that bump. There we go. That wasn't the bump. Yeah, see? That's what we want. Hey, hit the bump, hit the bump. Like I said, it takes a bit of practice. Especially when you're going to reverse. Crap. Okay, swerve it to the right. No. Never mind. Why is this so hard? I'm making it hard. Just spin. Yeah, don't make the yes, don't make this difficult. <laughs> Yeah, just do that. How's that look? I got a bump here, right? No, there's no bump. Wow, look at that. That's the kind of stuff I'm talking about. <laughs> I wish I could do this in more games. It's a bronze, really? Okay, so I need to get 35 seconds to get the silver? No? See what we can do. 35, huh? Nope. Nope. See, this music kind of funky too, so that's what I'm talking about. Alright. Ah! Darn it! Nope. Need more boost. Just a second. I'm not going to be able to get the 35 seconds, am I? Okay, I'm going to have to redo this. Darn it. Let's try again. 35 seconds, come on. We need to get 5.35. Maybe 5.25, I think, is the time limit. There we go. One down. Darn it, should I get the spin going? Okay, should I get the spin going? Probably I'll get the goals to keep the spin. Wow, look at that. Okay, we got this, we got this. I'm going to get the silver. Yes! Okay, I don't know what I need to do to get the gold, though. But you saw what I did right there. <laughs> Pretty much just kept the spin going. Okay, one more time. We'll do the side swipe in the video, don't worry. 
Darn it! Ah, kind of wanted, wanted to keep it going. Darn it! Okay, let's try that again. <laughs> we'll only do it one more time, don't worry. I have other, I have other vehicles to practice with. Nope, didn't get it. Spin, 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 da! Didn't get it. Yeah, didn't get it there either. Nope, not there either. Yeah, screw this up. Well, there's my bump. And I get my spin going. Okay, let's hit the bump, hit the bump, hit the... No, screw the bump. Okay, screw the bump. Okay, I messed that up, that's okay. I'm done. I got my silver. I'm ready to move on. Okay, so what's over there? Um, Argent Towers. Yeah, it's another uh, four vehicle course. We'll do that later. So we have a side swipe and that. So we'll do the side swipe in the video. This has been a bunch of vehicle tutorials, all things considered. Okay. Hit uh, max. Hit hearts at its maximum extension. So you want to go directly in between those b buildings if you want to keep it, if you want to attack if you want to make the attack as strong as possible the number of attacks we have with that little um side swipe attack right there they're limited so we have to collect those blue ammo boxes to give ourselves more charges so let's go a little bit more slowly Aim the rb button okay that's done Got a charge. So I have 26 charges. You can see on the bottom left hand corner of the screen there. Now you see that? I'm too far away from the other building. So I'm not able to blow it up when I shoot. So ideally I would have gotten I would have I would have done that. Bash both sides simultaneously, but I messed it up. So Okay, one more. Uh that. Yeah. Takes a bit of, it's a bit of technique, like I said. This game is not brainless. There's a, some technique to it. I'm not wild about the side swipe, but you do need it for some levels. So. I've been promoted. Yay. What'd I get? Well, I guess I'm a sure. I got the gold. Wow. Um, I don't think I deserve that. But I, can, I can easily do better than that. But that's okay. We're going to end that. Okay, so what do we have available here? Yeah, we have that, um, actually, just a second. 